jaminya ya di kalau anu dibakar buat pakan ternak kalau dibakar diambil dibakar hasilnya kurang bagus tanahnya jadi keras Halo Primatani Badi As we know, rice is the main food commodity in Indonesia To meet these food needs Farming activities must be carried out continuously. However, this activity also turned out to have a fairly serious impact, which is declining in land resources. This will also get worse if it is not accompanied by the return of organic matter or nutrients to the land. Another habit that is often done by abu farmers is burning straw in the rice fields after harvesting. The activity of burning straw apart from not returning organic matter also decreasing the activity of soil microorganisms drastically. We need to know that soil microorganisms have a very important role in fertilizing the soil. In this video, we will share how the straw doesn't need to be burned but decomposed into compost. The first thing that needs to be done is to let the harvested straw dry out and then do the plowing. After plowing, we prepare the Deco Prima solution. Dissolve one sachet of Deco Prima into one liter of water and left for 3 to 24 hours. After left for 3 to 24 hours, dilute the Deco Prima solution into 90 liters of water. For an area of 1 hectare, we need 5 sachets of Deco Prima. Then, spray Deco Prima solution evenly on the plowed land. Transplanting activities can be done 3 to 10 days later. The following are the results of Deco Prima application 10 days after spraying. Kemarin sebelum asal habis dibaca disemprot pakai deko prima tanahnya cepat gembur jeraminya mudah hancur kalau yang nggak pakai deko prima tanahnya padat jeraminya masih belum hancur ini yang ini pakai deko prima yang ini enggak. So as we can see. The land that was sprayed with Deco Prima, the straw will be rooted faster and didn't cause an acid effect than the land that was not sprayed with Deco Prima. So, no need to worry anymore, cause it's very easy to make a straw fertilizer directly in the rice fields.